WA is home to the world's oldest continuous culture, 50,000 years in the making. So instead of driving deeper into the southwest, I'm stopping to see Bunbury through the eyes of Noongar people with a city tour with Troy Bennell. Hey Troy, how are you going? Hi. How are you? Oh, now that's the local greeting? That's it, yes. Fantastic. That's okay, it. so tell me about these tours of yours. How does it all work? Yeah, we pretty much start from here. It's a two hour walking tour. Mm -hmm. Start here in the Welcome to Country, then work our way through town, then up at the back beat. So that's it. Let's do the Welcome to Country. Let's I can't wait. It. Okay, the hand that you wave with. Yep. We want you to rub him under your armpit, your nail. Right. In your belly. Yeah. For your scent. Yeah. Then we pick up that sand and roll the sand in our hand. Yeah. Transfer the smell. Okay. And then we throw him in the water. We say Kaya. Kaya. Yep. Kaya being welcome. Means welcome. Hello. Yep. Okay. Now, the scent in the water. Yes. Is for the woggle? For the woggle, yeah, the yeah. rainbow serpent. This is the last place where he rested his head before he made that way to the ocean here. That pays homage to him, pretty much saying g'day to him. So this is um, a pretty important place for Noongar yep. people here in Bunbury, right? That's it. Our journey goes through the base of that hill and it's that whole connecting people and walking country. The journey through this delightful town is full of insights and the tour covers everything from Indigenous culture to modern culture, arts and history. The thing is, I've been to and through Bunbury so many times and there were so many things that I just didn't know, like the artworks here, street art murals, and this one is especially important. Mate, this one's yours. Yep. It's incredible. You've gone traditional art and you've used some quite traditional mm. colours, but you've also used words. Yeah, the language was really important. Sakaya, I know, welcome. Goomburup. Goomburup, yep. Right. Where's that? Goomburup is Bunbury. Wyalup is just down the laneway. So these are all areas all around All local this. names and the reference up, the first part is the meaning. Yep. And the last part is place of. Place of. And this is artwork. They're just amazing. Look at that over there. Yeah, it's been pretty stunning, eh? All the mob working together on the one weekend. There are a lot of stories along the way and a lot of things that you'll learn and places that are very important, like while up Rocky Point. Now this is a very sacred place, a burial site and home to ancient basalt rocks, 130 million years in the making. It is beautiful here. Yeah, it's pretty stunning, eh? Mm. Um, we have a huge history here and this place is really significant. Just over the hill, we have Aboriginal burial site. The area is called Wyalup, and Wyalup means the morning place, burial site. Up there, the place is called Karlagup, like a ceremony ground, but Karlagup is a place of fire. Right. And these are fire rocks. 130 million year old basalt, right? Yeah, that's what they say, you know, culture, connection, ocean. All in sort of one fusion that you just take people on a journey through, and it's very enriching. And if you're heading down south, don't drive past Bunbury. We're the gateway to the southwest, but um, let's lock the gate and steer them this way. <laughs> I love it. Good on you, mate. Thanks. Done, brother. Cheers.